Regenerative medicine is gaining uh, increasing importance simply because of our aging population. As we know, age-related diseases such as cardiovascular disease, kidney disease, cancer and stroke all are increasing rapidly in our aging society. Regenerative medicine is an interdisciplinary field that aims to develop signs and tools to restore our diseased or injured uh, tissues and even the whole organs. Remedies will start with seven focus areas. First, cardiovascular regeneration for heart disease. Second, skeletal muscle regeneration for sarcopenia or muscle wasting. Third, neuro regeneration for Alzheimer's disease. Fourth, eye regeneration for age-related eye diseases. Fifth, hemopoietic regeneration for blood cancers. Sixth, mesenchymal regeneration for bone marrow failure. And last but not least, skin regeneration for burns and wounds. Within our academic medical centre, there are already experts in different areas of regenerative medicine. On top of that, we also have complementary platforms and facilities such as uh, pathology and pharmacology, bioimaging and bioinformatics, and uh, flow cytometry. In addition, we are trying to develop cutting-edge technologies in uh, stem cell biology, uh, gene regulation, as well as uh, genomic editing uh, to advance our research in uh, uh, regenerative medicine and also put us in the forefront of the field. Remedies will focus on the upstream research such as uh, stem cell biology and genomic editing, while uh, SDCT will focus on clinical trials and translate them into clinical applications to benefit the patients. We're all made up of cells, and cells are like soldiers that help us to be able to repair damaged tissue, as well as to help us fight invaders to our body. Cell therapy is like a living drug that when given to a patient, continues to help the patient throughout the lifetime of the patient by continuing to grow more cells and continuing to be able to produce the beneficial effects, uh, whether in terms of fighting cancer or repairing degenerative tissue. The STCT was set up to bring together the tremendous talent that we have in basic research and cell therapy with our excellent clinical teams so that we might be able to bridge the gap between research and clinical for our patients in terms of diagnostics, therapeutics and treatment outcomes. Remedis is the engine that will drive the basic research that fills the clinical trials and applications that are going to be meaningful for patients in cell therapy in the realm of regenerative medicine. We're looking forward to be able to translate many of the clinical therapies that are currently being developed through SDCT into clinical practice through clinical trials facilitated by the Sing Health Investigational Medicine Unit as well as the Clinical Trials Research Centre in SGH and the Clinical Trials Unit in the National Cancer Centre. I think cell therapy is going to be the next big revolution in medicine. As these cells are made more effective and precise, we will be able to target cancer cells while sparing normal cells, to mend the broken heart, to give sight to the blind, to treat neural degenerative diseases like Parkinson's and maybe Alzheimer's. We are so much looking forward to how patients will be able to benefit from these therapies as they become realities in future.